Oh my god, it was the same case with you. Where? Excuse me. Hello everybody, I'm Christopher Koshisunga, and today I'm with the cast and crew of Project Virus. Real quick, why don't you guys um, uh, introduce yourself real quick, just say your name and what you guys do. Uh, we'll start with Danielle. Okay. Um, I'm Danielle Reyes, and I'm playing Dre. I'm Meg Colburn, and I play Abby. Hey guys, I'm Koda Marcus, and I play Nathan. Uh, I am Andrew Fisk, and I am the series director. Great. So uh, today we're going to have you guys be playing the newlywed Q&A, which is uh, fitting because you've all sort of just met each other, kind of. You all sort of finally got together and are going to be doing this project for the next two years, so you guys are engaged for the next two years. So um, we'll start with these questions. Uh, feel free to just yell out whenever you guys want to. So the first question is, how did everyone meet? Okay. <laughs> so Danielle is my best friend, and um, we met because we both we met not through the show, but rather because we both had crushes on someone last year. Who is it? And so we bonded. <laughs> well, I mean, two I, different someone's though. Two okay. different someone. We bonded but, over it. So we bonded over it, and like every time we would see each other, we like dish, and then we just mm -hmm. realized that our personalities were like. Do these guys know that you guys are crushing on them? Um. Yes, they were very aware. So when they watch this, they'll be like. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, there was that time in our lives. Yeah. I mean, I'm okay. I'm dating that person. Oh. oh. <laughs> I don't know like, still when this comes out, but we'll see. Sure. Oh, I'm just kidding. Don't worry. <laughs> um, I met Danielle, and uh, I saw you in company, and she had oh, a really? southern accent, and I was like, "Are you from Texas?" <laughs> and she was like, "No." I was like, "But you have an accent," and I was like, "No, I don't." I don't speak. <laughs> and then I met Meg. Um, through this, yeah. yeah. You guys met at the, the first meeting, right? Yeah. 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 I met uh, Danielle yeah. over a year ago. A year uh, ago, when I was playing Nathan. Yeah. yeah. Originally, me and her. Um, yeah. Meg, you worked on uh, one of my friend Bo Jameson's films, like first film we ever made here, Clean. Oh my gosh! That uh, was first so film long I ago. ever worked on in in college and everything, and met you through that. And then Coda just popped into the audition rooms. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And yeah, it was the happiest <laughs> person I've ever seen. Yeah, it was a pretty good time. Um, and I met I met Koshi by going into I went to his house because I was friends with one of his roommates and he was just like curled up on his bed when I came in. <laughs> and I think he said two words to me while his roommate told me his entire like life story. Really? Good. Yeah, I know like all the things you've done. Yeah, I know. All the things I've done. Okay. Um, when you all met each other, what was your first impression? <laughs> Okay, so Danielle was this incoming freshman who got cast in a in a play at our at our school, and I was so jealous. I was like, "Who is this girl coming in, like, thinking she's a, the hot sh?" Well, she was hot sh, and I was so jealous. <laughs> so that was my first impression of Jandel. Now we're friends. Yeah. I don't really remember. I remember seeing you all the time, like in the cap and stuff, because Meg does everything. Like she's on like every like student body thing, whatever you call it in college. Um yeah, she does all the things. And so I was just like, she seems cool. I don't really know her that well. I don't even remember. I think I just wanted to be your friend, but like last year I wanted to be everyone's friend. That's true. So that's how I still want to yeah, that's true. That's true. We're forced friends now. We are. I met Coda the first time, and like, um, I saw you in the theater, and I was like, who is he? He is so cute and spunky. Well, yeah, I wanted to be his friend. Animals? Yeah, and I was like, I want to be oh. his best friend, and now I'm obligated to be his best friend for two years. <laughs> <laughs> I won. Under contract. I won. Under contract and everything. <laughs> Mainly, I've just seen you all act, so you're just. A big group of talented people. Oh. That's what I first saw. No, like it's Classic still directors. No, out. like it's still not, still not proving me wrong so far. So I remember when I first met you, I was like, you look like what was the name? James Franco or Dave Franco? Yeah, uh, Dave Franco yeah, because like Dave my Franco. my girlfriend Lara yeah. was like Dave Franco because we were all in the same. Yeah, we were room. all in the same room. Yeah, like Dave Franco. That's a good <laughs> yeah, I, remember, I met you a year ago, about more than a year ago. We met through like a mutual friend. And you were gonna be on virus, and I was like, this girl it's works. Warm, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. But yeah. I, mean, I got stuff of this. Like, I was just like sitting on the quad one day. He's like, yeah, we're doing the thing. And then one day I saw him like another time, and yeah. he was like, hey, want to I, think I remember ninja? when you walked in the room. I was like, she smiles way too much for me right now. <laughs> I think I remember that. I was like, I was like, I was like super stressed. I was like super tired. I was like, I can't have this energy right now. 
but it was good. That was fun. <laughs> so my only confession during auditions, I thought that the character was like, because she told me the character was a, was bad in the original one. Oh yeah, so, was yeah, so I came in in my like mm. high heels and my like turtleneck and was like, I'm gonna intimidate the crap out of these you people. Did. Good. Yeah. <laughs> it was a good audition. Yeah. 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 yeah, it was And then I met you through auditions and oh my god, it was the same case with you. Where? Excuse me. Was it the same case? Oh that was four. Four <laughs> day. <laughs> Uh, when I saw you, you, you popped in the audition. Um, you, the same case with her. You had so much energy that I was like, I was like, hey guys! <laughs> yeah, now I feel like I was like, what about that energy? No, not not yeah. I like came in and I was like, I'm not gonna, I don't need to show them that I really want this. Ooh. <laughs> and you got past it, so. But I did, I was really freaking out in my brain. It was, if you ask uh, Nico, I was outside like bouncing up and down. Yeah. He was like, what are you going for right now? And I was like, chill, I'm chill, it's chill. <laughs> Um, so actually, everyone on the, in the table has at least a little bit of theater background. What was yeah. your favorite show that you've been in so far? Richard the Third. Ooh. Ooh. What'd you play? Yeah. Aww. Yeah. yeah. I died. I was like, Spoiler. Spoiler. Oh, spoiler. If anyone hasn't read it. Foreshadowing. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> <laughs> I hate when he does that. <laughs> <laughs> that was in my miss. I mean, I really loved, in high school, I got to do um, Taming of a Shrew, and I was Bianca Manola, who was like my spirit animal, so that was really great. And then, um, probably Company, which is like my most recent really one, fun. that was really, really fun. I think my, uh, the first show I was ever in, I was 11, and I played Marion Peru in The Music Man, Aww. so that was one of my favorites, that's what got me into theater, but also like, recently, I just did a show called Girls Like That, so good. and I was, I was really Scarlet. And oh my gosh, it was so awesome. Loved it. Um, is there any show that you guys want to be in? Oh, Jesus. Like ever? All of them. Um, oh. Dream roll. Bonnie Parker and Bonnie and Clyde. Make it happen. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> um, make it happen, it's Bonnie. Back to me. Oh, no. Don't come back to me. Does it have to be a play? Can it be a TV show? Yeah, but I was sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shouting out here. I want to be Meg. Megan from That's Young easy. Justice. Live action, I want to be Megan so bad, so I can just go, Hello, Megan! <laughs> oh, can I be in Game of Thrones? Like, anything in Game of Thrones. Sure. I want to be the Beast Boy in the live action <gasps> Teen Titans! That's what, is that like a No, he is. Yeah, I'm yeah, happy! Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna do it. It's gonna happen. Like, oh. I would just do Cabaret again. Ooh. I'd want to do Hamilton. Well, who wouldn't? Yeah, who wouldn't? That's such a good answer. I'm nervous. Yeah. God, God. <laughs> Um, on this show, is there any? If you could, who would you switch roles with? Director. Kind Whoever of Nicole's character is. Ooh, that's oh, a good one. but they don't know anything about that. Oh, yet, right. So, <laughs> yeah. So I guess I'm among you three. Oh. Sorry. Among oh, you three. I'm pretty happy where I'm. I'm feel like I'm sitting pretty, yo. Okay. <laughs> sitting pretty, yo. I mean, Dre, Dre speaks to me on a very like we're very similar. Such boring answers. I'm sorry. <laughs> Wait, okay, I would love to do Nate. Though. Yeah, I'll kill, I'll kill opposite. Coda and I will become Nate. Okay, okay. Wow. does that make you feel like, better? Like, you know the thing that I do that you don't like? You just did it. I know. <laughs> I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. Wait, I want to be Dre, because I feel like... So, so we'll just try you it. know how you're... Oh, I don't know why I was about this. Because you're... I'm kind of like the, like... You're like... Protective figure, you know? But I feel like in real life it's kind of the opposite. Cause you're like, a, I'm getting real deep for no reason. Cause you're like a sophomore and like, I don't know. And like yesterday when like, no, oh god. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna leave it at that. Oh, you yeah. can talk about like, experiences on set, you just can't give away spoilers. Cause like, remember when like, I was piggybacking yeah, you and you know, you're like, it's okay. And like, I was cold and you're like, it's okay. Like I feel like it's kind of like opposite in a way. So it's interesting to like, yeah. Uh, just me knowing where everyone ends up, I really want to play her. Just <laughs> knowing where everything bothered ends up. <laughs> um, don't so, know. He doesn't tell us anything. He's so excited, <laughs> yeah. and I'm excited that I don't know. I was gonna say, like, I love yeah, that we don't know, but I hate it. Yeah. 
Uh, so you guys are actually going to be in this huge video game world, so I'm curious, like, growing up, what was your favorite video game? <gasps> oh, Wait, can we say Smash Bros? Ooh. Lost Kingdoms? Have you guys played Lost Kingdoms? Digimon World 4. Ooh! Oh, uh, I played Minecraft. Well, I mean, that's like... <laughs> <laughs> can, we say, can, we, can we say one that's like then and one that's now? Sure. Yes. Yeah, okay. Yeah. I love League of Legends. Hey. Same. Go. Oh, I don't know. Give oh, okay. me time to think. Um, okay, Mario Party. Just like oh, all of them. Specifically 4. Love Mario Party 4. I don't know the last time I've lost it. I have eight. Um, and right now, Borderlands 2 and the pre-sequel. Okay. <laughs> Everything. I, I feel the Mario Party hype. Like, in my house, like, we always play games like that just because, like, it's easier, like, because I have younger siblings. Yeah. So Mario Party 8 was, like, my jam. Mario Kart um, for games. I'm terrible at Mario Kart. Games um, Mario Kart I'm 64. so bad. Uh, but also, 64 is good on my N N64, Mario Party, um, Pokemon <laughs> Stadium, and Pokemon Snap is my favorite game of all of them. Mm -hmm. Which That's is really fun. Funny. Yeah. Which we literally just take pictures. But I love the apartment yeah. and just like play that yeah. constantly. Yeah. Yeah. My N64 sound doesn't work anymore. So. I grew up on like old Nintendo, so like Punch Out. For which sure. is like amazing, or uh, the Nintendo 64 James Bond Goldeneye game, yeah. 007, <gasps> which like first oh, person man. shooter, yeah, super, yeah. super fun. Uh, but like now, Far Cry. Far Cry, Far Cry has been okay. like a jam Far is really good. for the past like yeah. Why is Donkey Kong not a donkey? Can someone post that in Wait. the comments? <laughs> like, can someone tell me in the comments, please, why Donkey Kong is Star Fox. Is donkey in Star it. Fox is fun. <laughs> oh. I love the GameCube Star Fox. Okay. Yeah, that was really fun. Yeah. Tack and the Power of Juju. Oh my god. Yes, bro. Yes. Jack and Daxter. Jack and Daxter. Jack and Daxter is my jam. I watched a movie. There's a movie now, too. It's pretty good. Yeah. It's Isn't it actually good? good? What? It's okay, yeah. Sly Cooper. Sly Cooper. That's my next okay. tattoo. Yeah, that's and, your next tattoo. Uh, yeah, I'm getting the, the oh, insignia, that's insignia cool. that he leaves. Oh, Kingdom Hearts, too. Kingdom Hearts is fun. Oh, <laughs> I haven't played. What's, what, what are you coaching? Oh, yeah, coaching. Oh, uh, uh, Pokemon. Yeah, probably. all Just around. Like, Just yeah, anyone around. who's yeah. been on this YouTube channel knows that it's been <laughs> yeah. non-stop Pokemon uh -huh. for like so long. Yeah. Um, speaking of YouTube, you guys, uh, do you guys have any favorite YouTubers? Like, other than me, obviously. <gasps> John Tron. John. <laughs> The YouTuber star Coda Marcus, um, is <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> you wanna go subscribe to him now? Yeah. <laughs> um, oh gosh, growing up, I, th I think he still makes videos. I was always a really big fan of uh, Swift Karate Chop, Matthew okay. Brown. He makes these amazing videos called Ask Swifty, and I don't know if he still does them, but like, I was just always the biggest fan sure. of his. Yeah. I switch a lot. Like I go through phases of like watching cooking videos and then watching vlogs and oh, watching DIY yeah. stuff. Um, but I love Broadway.com because I'm a nerd. Oh, um, me too. And yeah. also like right now I'm really into these vloggers. They're okay, baby. They're very cute. Um, I, there's like a million. I can't think of anyone right now. Zoella, I love Zoella. Zoella is really cool. I told you I better, yeah. What? Well, save that for another time. But yeah, <laughs> yeah. I like Zoella too. I hate John you more Tron. and more. <laughs> John Tron's yeah. John Tron's really good. I love PewDiePie. Ugh. You don't know what I mean? <laughs> okay, okay, okay. That was like the first YouTuber I got into. Uh, that's not, does not make fun of us. Oh no, <laughs> PewDiePie is fun for us. <laughs> when you guys were first casted, what came on through your mind? Like, how did you react, I guess? You're a weird case. because Yeah, I was ago. gonna say, yeah. I... This happened a long time ago, and yeah. I was a different character. And then Project Virus like completely changed and became something different. And you were like, do this character, and I was like, okay, cool. And then I just kind of like lived with Dre for a while now, and she's very, very much like me, like in the sense of like, um, I don't know, just like how she cares for other people, and her like energy that she has is very similar to what I have. Sure. So I don't, I don't know like how I reacted when I found out, just because I didn't really like. There wasn't a moment where it was like, sure. like, you're Dre. Yeah. Like you got this role, like. It okay. was, Kind of like, I, think I was pretty anxious. Like I was like excited, but I didn't really know what exactly to be excited for. I mean, I had like hype man number one over here, <laughs> just like all over my shoulder, like constantly, like oh my god, oh my god, this has been great. So yeah. that helped a lot. I was definitely really excited for that. Um, but now it's just I'm just like waiting because I want to get on set. Oh, I know. Yeah, it's the biggest fans yeah. of Project Virus or yeah. Project yeah. Virus. Yeah, yeah. that's yeah. true. That's the best feeling. I was yeah. nervous too because I remember on the poster it said that 
to have like musical experience and sure. I don't really have any at all. So, but you also hyped me up about it. And yeah. You did too. Like I remember, like when you started messaging me, I'm like, this sure. is real. And then I watched the videos that you guys made. Um, yeah. When like Trey um gets to the the cool stuff. Sure. sure. And I'm like, <laughs> wait, this is gonna be so cool. Yeah. And this is also like my real like first like real film stuff. So like, oh cool. Stuff. Yeah. yeah. And then you just recently, like this past like half year, got the job as the director. How did you feel? Yeah, um, it was about, yeah, about six months ago? Yeah, about something like that. Um, I didn't know where it was going. Um, sure. Definitely, like, from about six months ago where the scripts were, I think uh, you gave me like eight episodes. Yeah. And all of that is no longer... Oh yeah, like, it's completely different. It's completely different. Yeah. So it's like... From where we were, for where you were two years ago, from where I was a year ago, and all of us, it's changed so much. Yeah. And just, I guess, that undertaking so, was like a little nerve wracking. Everyone has that nerves, yeah. and you yeah. can tell that on the first day, everyone had their nerves. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, that's get over it pretty quick. Yeah. Um, so finally, uh, you three uh, are currently in the middle of filming episode one. How do you feel about it so far? Great crew, great cast. Oh, yeah. like, pleasure to work with. I yeah. don't have any problem. It's uh, it's fun. I think we can both agree that like we're still like I don't know. No, I think like the first scene like was a little like, <laughs> yeah. robotic. Yeah, we were so nervous like the first day on set. We were both like talking to each other the whole time. We're like, like yeah, okay, like, I'm so nervous to worry about it. <laughs> yeah, we were like reassuring each other. We're like it's fine. And then like I feel like once we did like the second, it just starts to feel started, like yeah. It was just like that first shot that we were like, oh, I'm so nervous. And then once we got into it, we were like, yeah, this is, oh, you know, like once we really got. It, in the characters and like overall, I feel like it's been really smooth and like Coda and I have bonded a lot since yeah, we've been like yeah. working on the show, yeah, which is super cool. Yeah, really. And we probably <laughs> <laughs> we probably annoy everyone on set, but it's fine. Yes, we well, must. Yeah, we, so I'm it. not on set, and you already. Oh, okay. Give me that board! Yes, ma'am! Hey y'all, thank you for watching this video. Make sure you subscribe to Koshi Sushi and uh, Project Virus comes out February 2nd. Also, thank you to Loot Crate for making this all possible for us. You can sign up for Loot Crate on lootcrate.com slash virus. And if you want 10% off, then you can type in the code virus2017. We also want to thank Audible for making this possible. Sign up for Audible on audibletrial.com slash virus. Thanks, guys!